Yes guys, and today we've got another one of these Kershaw meals. Today's one is the chip shop chicken curry with rice and chips. 474 calories. Now obviously again, picture doesn't look that much, but the last one was nice. So we're going to try it. You know exactly where it's going. We've got oven, uh, oven recommendation there, but we're not doing that. We're going in the microwave. And it's going to be what looks like about sort of 10 minutes ish let's open it up and let's have a look inside right so we've got a little portion of rice there and uh yeah a mixture of chicken and chips there the strips of chicken look quite big and it's covered in curry sauce so i'm hoping that it's nice nice curry sauce like you get from a chip shop but again i'm not expecting too much uh, again, and it, obviously again it was on the three for five pound or it's two quid on its own from farm food so let's get it in the microwave let's have a closer look at what we've got and let's mark it out of ten at the end so out of the microwave guys it smells pretty nice there doesn't look like there's that much chicken in there but I'm going to get it all on a plate and give you a closer look Let's dig into this and let's see how, see how it tastes. Right, so we've got a bit of chicken there. It's difficult to tell the chicken in amongst the chips because it's the same sort of shape and length, but we'll have a go at him. Not bad. Take the, the meat's pretty tough, if I'm honest, but not a bad taste. There's it's nice chicken taste to it, but just the meat's quite tough. Right, again, the chips... Not sure how they're going to be because they've been in the microwave, but we'll try them out. Again, similar to the one I had the other day. Uh, pretty decent. Nice chips. Let's have a go at the rice. The rice on its own isn't much. I'm going to mix it all in and I'll, uh, I'll try that out. That's better. Look at that. That's like a bit like what I'd go for at the Chinese. You know, and you can get one of them sort of... Uh, the meals in the uh, in the little boxes, and you can get sort of chicken fried rice, chips, and curry sauce, something like that. Hmm, spot on like that. That is really nice. Yeah, the rice is too plain to be on its own. You've got to have the sauce all over it with the chips and the chicken. Saying that, I've only had one bit of chicken, and I can't seem to find any more. Oh no, we do have another bit here. Got a couple of little bits there. Right, I'm going to uh, finish waffling. I'm going to finish this off and I'm going to come back to you at the end and mark it out of 10. All finished, guys. Again, absolutely spot on. Can't fault it. And like I said, it does remind me of when you get sort of the chicken fried rice, chips and the, and the curry sauce in the tray from uh, the Chinese. But I'll tell you what. It's better than some of the Chinese I've had out there. It was absolutely spot on. Only little criticism. It shows on the picture there's loads of chicken. Um, yeah, there wasn't that much chicken. You got sort of two, three bits. But for the price that you're paying, <clears throat> again, can't grumble. Curry sauce, really nice. Chips, again, just nice chips. The rice on its own, a bit plain, but it is rice is rice. Mixed in with the sauce. It was nice and um, yeah, absolutely spot on. I'll definitely have it again. And it's like I say, two quid, you can't really go wrong. Uh, so yeah, give it a 10. It's going to be 10 out of 10. Can't give it anything less. I couldn't, couldn't fault it, really couldn't fault it. But anyway, guys, as always, thanks for watching. If you could like and subscribe, I'll be very grateful. Leave a comment if you've ever tried this before. Um, I'll be interested to know what you thought of it, see if you liked it as much as I did. Thanks guys, take care, I'll see you next time. Cheers.